Hello guys, this is Pavel Skorop from Laravel Daily Team. This is episode number three and three days in a row of Laravel Daily, Laravel Business YouTube channel. Uh, and today I want to show you some examples of number one demand on the market currently in Laravel or actually in web development in general. So if you have spare time and want to learn something or if you are quite a newcomer and want to learn something specifically to, to receive more work, more clients, I have three letters for you. ABI. So APIs are the hottest trend on the market in general and uh, communication between various platforms, uh, projects including including Laravel to Laravel communication from like external sources, integration with external services like MailChimp or general email sending, um, like SMS sending, anything that is not, uh, that doesn't have Laravel package, you would have to go through their API and connect to that. So uh, I, I can show you three examples from Upwork. Uh, it's not a secret basically that I find clients via Upwork quite a lot. Uh, I, sh I probably will shoot separate video how, how I find them. It's not that bad as many people think that Upwork is a piece of shit basically because there are no clients there, no good clients. Uh, this is not true, but that's a topic for another episode. So, uh, for, But for today I want to show you three examples from uh, API related jobs on Upwork. So how did I find them? I went to Upwork, uh, put in Laravel, into search and here are results. And these are three results only from uh, from the latest, like it's uh, from from the night based. Well, eight nine hours, so it's all today, like within twenty four hours, and and it's it's only the beginning. I guess I would find ten or twenty more uh, just for today, because uh, whatever the project is in Laravel, it has quite a big potential for using for using external APIs or even within the project itself more and more um, projects are moving to front end so you have to build api with all the database functionality like getting stuff putting stuff there and then you would have some angular or react uh, js front end or dashboard or something like that and your laravel part of of the of the application would serve only as api so that's getting more popular including like various topics like API authentication, various packages with that like Dingo for APIs, um, like error management, logging, uh, what, what to do when API is not working, how to, how to prevent that and uh, the whole related stuff with that including Angular or React. Even for myself, uh, I've been a PHP and Laravel and backend developer for like 10 or 15 years. Uh, and now, now I have to switch to Angular or React. I uh, haven't done it uh, like really actively yet, but I've tried. I have some projects on that. And um, I look pretty, pretty, <laughs> pretty messed in the morning, sorry. Uh, yeah, so uh, Angular is one way to go. And uh, related to that, I want to raise kind of a question to myself and to you guys, Lumen Framework. So Laravel has a micro framework uh, called Lumen, which, which has primary goal of serving as API, like really quick, uh, mostly for APIs. And I've checked this morning how many uh, installs it has. So if we compare Laravel framework it has 20 million installs, quite impressive. Lumen has only 870,000, which is like 20 times or 25 times less. Uh, so personally, I don't really believe in, in Lumen as, as a solution because I believe that it's, it, it has the case, but the case is really narrow and quite a lot of times it will eventually still grow into something bigger like Laravel. Uh, but if there is a case for Lumen, maybe, but I wouldn't uh, advise to to put too much money on that. Not not even because it's a it's, it's not a bad framework, it's not a bad technical solution, but it has less uh, community input, uh, less like Stack Overflow topics, less help you can find online, including like Laracasts. Uh, so don't invest too much in Lumen. Uh, I would advise to build APIs on Laravel still. Uh, 
it's not like it, it doesn't have too much drawbacks so that's the thing I wanted to tell you today uh, learn and use APIs and you will have more potential to find clients to find work and to to go further in your Laravel career that's it for now see you in the next episode of Laravel daily video